Hey everybody! So as you know, my name is Kianti Ashe and this is Blue Aura Healing Guidance and Tarot. This is going to be an update for our Aries, okay? So if you are Aries, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Jupiter, okay? Mars or Saturn, doesn't matter. This is intended for you, alright? Let us see what messages come through for you all. Let us see, let us see. Messages for our Aries. And thank you, Spirit. Messages for our Aries. What do we have to say to our Aries? Thank you all so, so, so much for all of your contributions to the channel. I really do appreciate it. All of your likes, shares, downloads, and subscriptions. Thank you, guys. I honor and value you, okay? So let us see what messages Spirit has for you on today. I feel quite a few. First chakra, okay, so we're talking about your uh, assets, the things that make you feel secure, okay, the things that you own or that you have attached to your name, all right? This is like when you do something, doing it well, because, well, you want to make sure that you're not out here looking crazy with your name attached to it. Then we have deceit. I feel like, wow, this is how you feel about things and you go about everything like this, like, I got to make sure I do what I do, how I do it, because my name is attached to it. There is somebody who knows that and who wants to kind of of see you fall or fail okay and i don't like that energy it doesn't feel good at all okay so let us see this is like somebody that's pretending to to be a friend or pretending to be close to you this is crazy then we have door to personal healing and happiness okay so i feel like despite the fact that this is going on you're not even focused on that you're just focused on stabilizing yourself doing what you got to do you may even be aware that this person is doing this to you but you're not allowing it to stop you from achieving your goal of being happy being healed being prosperous okay and achieving what's necessary underlying energy here is action so i feel like the action that maybe um you guys need to take at this time is you need to cut off whoever this person is for sure all right that's the action that i would be trying to take okay like i don't know who this person is but i feel this energy where they're extremely manipulative they tell you what they want you to know okay i also feel this energy where <clears throat> this person they have like really light hair as well okay like i'm seeing auburn or like orange okay like natural redhead type okay as well could be what it is let us see first chakra why are you here for aries we have the Four of Coins and the Ten of Staffs. Yeah, you guys are working really, really hard with this Ten of Staffs and saving up everything that you got. I actually see somebody going to start a savings account, okay? I feel here like you finally have enough to go and put something away you feel, okay, that you would be comfortable with. And so you're about to go and do that, okay? That's what I see here with this energy. Let us see temperance yep you guys are in a place now where you've healed everything okay about yourself that you felt you didn't before all right let us see what's going on with this four of pentacles we have the magician energy so you guys have literally like <laughs> transformed your situation overnight okay like it was not the greatest a little while ago and you guys have really put in some work so i'm proud of you guys you've done everything that was necessary with this ten of wands okay this is staying up long hours waking up early mornings like hell sometimes not even going to sleep all right we have the will of fortune here and because of that now you're going to be rewarded look at the underlying energy so you went from saving everything that you have you know and uh, feeling a bill a little bit um insecure to feeling super secure super stable okay so let us see what's going on with deceit what's happening here and why all right i feel like because of everything that you went through spirit is on your side all right so i really feel like that's why you're not even worried about whoever this person is that's deceitful because you know that spirit's got you covered okay front back and sides here's your energy with the queen of wands all right queen of staffs energy so queen of wands is you all right very vivacious and this person knows it they see you as very stable at this point in your life okay i feel like this could be the same person we were talking about a few readings back guys all right for those of you who are um new here and are like what the hell you talk about there's someone who's around you that pretends to be a lover or pretends to be a friend but this person they just know that they can take advantage of you all right it says here the hanged man all right so i feel like like i said you've been enlightened to this you know this about this person already so you're not going to accept their shitty offer 
offer anymore excuse my language but i'm just calling a spade a spade okay so let us see what else happens here with this deceit this person this energy seven of pentacles okay you recognize that they have ulterior motives also i feel here that this person they may be trying to invest into you a little bit more all right and maybe you feel like it's because they were enlightened to who you are and i feel like yeah that's true but they just want to take advantage of it okay they've been enlightened to who you are as in your capabilities your skill sets what you can truly do and they feel like oh this is a meal ticket for me i can just no you can't so we have the two of wands here i feel you still kind of being indecisive when it comes to whether or not you want to deal with this person okay i also feel this energy where they may be juggling between you and someone else so for those of you who have been here for a while you know what i'm talking about and for those of you who are new that's what I was talking about. So we have the full card here, okay? To clarify, doors to personal healing and happiness. This is the new beginning that Spirit promised to a lot of you, okay? So like I said before, the offer that you always wanted, accept, okay? Is not with this person anymore because you've been enlightened to who they are and how they treat you. So you're really ready now to go and start a new journey somewhere else with this full card, okay? By yourself. It says doors to personal healing and happiness. That's personal right so these two things flipped out we got the five of cups and we have the ten of swords this is like knowing the situation is over and done there's no going back and this is acceptance yet grief of the past grief of what never got to be or you know what was never what you expected it to be with that two of cups energy okay so going to be independent and single with this nine of pentacles all right focus completely and utterly on you let us see what else we can get for this door to wow that jumped out we got the three of swords okay so it's very heartbreaking here i feel like some of you may also hear from this person and they may be saying to you that you broke their heart but it's it's just to deceive you it's just to throw you off because they see that you've moved on without them it's just like how you know uh, ex senses that you're over it then they want to hey i'm still here like no okay so continue to stand your ground and fight for what you want you decided to go out there and get a new beginning here all right also we have the seven of cups where it wants you to consider your other options all right 77 all right so consider your other options all right also feel abundant somebody here is going to be rewarded and get a gift that they've been waiting on for a really long time from the universe simply because you decide to emotionally withdraw from this karmic and negative toxic draining situation okay so if this was your message or it resonated give it a thumbs up if you enjoy watching it give it a thumbs up and if you have yet to do so please do subscribe peace and peace